and commission. And uh, it's amazing what they do with the, the people they have. And uh, let's give them a round of applause. They are great. <laughs> I really want to welcome all of you to Richardson Park. This is a park for all of us. This is a park for the people. And I'll tell you what, I don't know if you've walked around this park yet, but you will understand when you walk around. This is a place that you can just walk around, relax, and feel like you're at home. And it's a special place you're going to find. And if you look around our parks, Don Isley Park, Colahatchee, they're all in the water. It's an amazing place in Wilton Manors. I don't know of any place like this that you can take a canoe and go around the entire city and stop at four different parks and enjoy life. It is an amazing, amazing place. And I thank everyone here that helped do that by letting us go out and get a, a park grant to have this park. So thank all of you for what you do for this. <laughs> it was an amazing vision a few years ago that, uh, I think it's been about five years, four and a half years. Jim Stork was the mayor then, and uh, he could not be here tonight. He's coming back from uh, overseas, and he's in Boston right now, but he, he said uh, best wishes to everyone. He's, he's so happy, can't wait to get back here and, and uh, see the park. But uh, I thank for his vision and, and the commission back then to really go out and push to, this is the time for parks. This is the time for the people to have the land that they need to relax. And uh, as you can see, I'll tell you what, it has become fabulous. I mean, it, it is, it is it's, it's, a, it's an awe when you come in here because the city is so small and this is such a beautiful park. It, it, it is simply amazing. When you, if you haven't gone, please, before you leave, walk around. It is, it is spectacular. It is very spectacular. Um, I'd like to say, uh, thank the uh, city manager and his team that uh, got in here and helped do this. A couple other people I want to thank. Jack Seiler. He was in the legislature, I think, about three years. And I think he was pulled uh, by every arm and leg uh, to get some, some funding here. Because this park is about, when it's finished, would be about seven to eight million dollars. It's a lot of money. The city is going to put in about 800000 that's it. Between the county and the state, it's an amazing job. And please, thank you, Jack, and, and thank you. For being here. We can never do this on our own. And I'll tell you, there's one special person I think we need to thank. And uh, he'll, he'll be coming up in just a minute. But uh, when this man came available, he could have very easily sold this to a developer and turned this into a townhome. And we went up to him and asked him, please, we would love to have first crack at buying this property. And he allowed us the time to see if we get the funding together to buy this property. And he sold it to us cheaper than he would have sold it to a developer. So I really want to give a round of applause for Judge Richardson. <laughs> Judge, he'll be up in here in just a minute, but when you see him afterwards, welcome, please, pat him on the back and say thank you, because he's well-deserved. 